hi welcome this is anub here and uh, in this video what we are going to see here is um, how to change uh, SCM CB okay from eval version to the full version so eval version is uh, evaluation version is only valid for 180 days and as you can see in the console uh, after 180 day, uh, days it it will get expired so so before that if you uh, if you have a product key you can uh, change it to full version okay so in this video i am going to explain how we are, how we can do that so first of all you need to have a product uh, product key sscmcb product key current branch product key otherwise um, we cannot perform this activity okay go to <clears throat> applications search for config okay config manager setup okay there's a shortcut uh, for config manager setup click on that yes okay next so only two options are enabled in this the one is perform site maintenance or reset or reset the site and the second one is uninstall the configuration manager site so i'm selecting the um, first enabled option that is perform site maintenance <clears throat> so in the site maintenance page you will get a list of options okay so reset site with no configuration changes modify sql server configuration modify sms provider configuration modify language configuration and the last one is upgrade the eval edition to the licensed edition okay so this is the one i'm going to perform i'm going to enter my key over here the normal accept licenses okay view logs what is happening in the log file okay it's almost completed i will close the console in a minute and we'll come back Core setup has completed. I will close it. Okay. I will open the console again. Config console. See. Uh, if you look at the console, there is no eval uh, evaluation uh, 180 days or something like that. It got removed, so uh, the <clears throat> it it is upgraded to the production uh, version now. When I say production, it's not. Don't get confused with the current branch TP version and production. So this is uh, this is my production uh, server. Uh, production version server and it was uh, it was uh, running under evaluation uh, so now I changed it to the full full version okay so uh, it won't expire after 180 days if you look at the path mm-hmm okay so that is it uh, 
on this video thank you for watching bye